Hello everyone, welcome back. It's Chris here, founder and CEO of Trademasters. So today we're going to look at one of the finance uh, sector company. It's called as Srinam Transport Finance and uh, the name is uh, familiar to everyone, I believe, and uh, it is a part of the Srinam uh, group. And uh, this is going to be a swing trading opportunity in Srinam Finance. And uh, since it's a swing trading opportunity, I'm not going to I'm not going to show the fundamentals of uh, Srinam Finance. I've already gone through it and it is looking really good. So there is nothing worrying on the fundamental aspect of Srinam Finance. So let's just go with the technical chart for now. And I'm going to keep this video short. So please don't skip and watch till the very end so that you understand uh, where exactly we're going to buy and what is going to be a stop loss and target. Okay, so let's get into the technical chart. So this is a one hour chart of uh, Srinam Finance, what I'm showing over here. And uh, if you can look over here, we have a uh, two gap ups. So this was the first gap up over here, and this was the second gap up over here. And after that, the stock uh, kept on climbing up like this, right? So this is a good uh, bullish uh, move, what I see in Sriram Finance for a short term. And uh, coincidentally, when you, sorry, when you plot a chart like this, or a pattern like this, you can see that it is actually forming a wedge pattern so this is a wedge pattern over here right so this wedge pattern was actually uh, the stock was trading in this wedge pattern for the last uh, couple of days for almost uh, 30 to 35 days and i was tracking this stock for, to give a breakout on the lower side so i was expecting a breakout on the lower side but the stock broke out on the upper side but it's still not going to be a problem because uh, we have a good risk reward setup over here and nonetheless where the breakout happens we have to take up an entry and stick to our uh, trading strategy and uh, stick to our money management and uh, risk reward then everything will be fine on the long run so we have a good entry option over here so this is where uh, sriram finance has uh, given a breakout right and if you look closely over here we have four can consolidation candles so this these two candles will be a trend reversal candle that is indicating a bullish trend and this is going to be a breakout candle and after that another green candle indicating the breakout is successful and the trend reversal from uh, sideways to uh, uptrend and after that you have a good uh, green candle indicating the uh, bullish continuation of this particular stock so Overall, I believe Sriram Finance is going to be a good stock for investment just within a short span of uh, uh, 30 days. So this is going to be a swing training opportunity in Sriram Finance and the maximum holding period is going to be 30 days for returns of almost 9%. So from here, this is going to be my best buying price and 9% is going to be my return. So that's approximately 2040 is going to be my target. Let me mark it over here. So 2040 is going to be my target for Sriram Finance. So that's approximately uh, close to 1000, sorry, 150 points rise in Sriram Finance just within a period of 30 days. So 30 days is the maximum period. Uh, what I'm talking about is the maximum period for Sriram Finance to take, uh, to reach a target of uh, 2040. It can take 30 days. So the stock can also reach a 2040 just within, just two or three days there's nothing stopping the stock once the momentum is built then the stock can uh, you know give an upper circuit and give the target just within a single day also but overall when you need when you are planning for a swing trade or when you're planning for any types of investment or any types of trade just need to consider the maximum possibility that that particular stock can take to give the target so that is the maximum ta uh, possibility is 30 days to for Sriram finance to reach a target of 2040 and coming to the stop loss and risk reward so this particular point is going to be my best buying zone, right? So my best buying zone is going to be around uh, 1865 or 1870 uh, around that particular point. So the stock is uh, 20 points above my best buying zone. So buy it in dips till uh, 1870 or 1865 and below this uh, previous low. So this particular point is going to act as my stop loss. So below this previous low, maybe around 17801 is going to be a good level of stop loss for me. And once my final target is done, <clears throat> I'm looking at a risk road of 1 is to 2. So for a risk of 1 point, my reward is going to be approximately 2 points. And that's basically for a risk of uh, 87 points, my reward is going to be 172 points. So that's basically a risk road of 1 is to 2. Okay. So overall, to summarize today's technical viewpoint, Sriram Finance is trading in a wedge pattern and we have a breakout on the upper side. So uh, this is a good uh, breakout uh, 
you know uh, stock what i what we see over here and entry point is going to be buy and dip still 1870 uh, and my target point is going to be 2040 it's going to be a single target and my stop loss is going to be 1780 anything below that particular point and uh, this is going to be a swing trading opportunity with a maximum holding period of 30 days okay so yeah that pretty much concludes the technical viewpoint on Sriram finance i hope this video was useful and i hope you learned some informative things from this video if you like my analysis please do click on the like button and if you uh, you know uh, want to uh, contribute to uh, the channel then i would uh, recommend you subscribing to the channel and show us your love and support i'll see you guys in the next video with another exciting stock prediction till then it's bye from chris take care bye bye and thank you for watching